All right, we're going to send it over to Storm Team 10's meteorologist Chris Kozart for a look on the latest about Hurricane Helene and also Chris it feels good outside here locally. Best timing for us, worst timing for Florida and across the southeastern portion of the country as a cold front has moved through uh, Acadiana, Louisiana, and really it is feeling nice out there. And that front is keeping everything well east of us. And you can start to see Helene now as it is continuing to gain strength now up to category two strength here. And that eye wall starting to become exposed here and clear out. And that's another indication that this system is going through an intensification process and still expected to be a major hurricane before landfall sometime this evening there. Uh, looks like east of Tallahassee. It's going to be close to Tallahassee here for the center of rotation. Winds right now at 105 miles per hour. Again, making landfall sometime late this evening after dinner time here as possibly a strong top end category three hurricane to a category four hurricane. And I know all those alignment are going out to Florida, but they're going to have a significant issue with winds and power outages across Georgia and the Carolinas as the system makes landfall overnight. Uh, the Category 1 strength still possible across Georgia and the Carolinas all the way into Friday morning. We'll have a full look at our forecast coming up in about 10 minutes. All right, thank you, Chris. And to stay up to date on the latest weather conditions in your area, download our free Calify weather app. You can scan the code you see right there on your screen and download it straight from there. Or you can go to the Google Play or the Apple App Store and download from there. Even though Louisiana is in the